アホは出かける大きな学生をって愛しさオタク真面目に就職する気なし高カメラ通って自転車こいでまだ知らない景色を見つけ出して雨の日でも雪の中でも指先不明の大冒険アホにはできないこと山ほどあるけれど大丈夫アホにしかできないことの方が多い気がするよ根拠はないけど俺を信じてろ目を閉じて願う日常シーズン2Appears as if Mugata is only 33 kilometers away, which means actually making it there today has become a reality. However, there is a question that is to be told, asked Should I get the hotel today or tomorrow? Because I'm gonna get it for two nights. I don't know, maybe I could, because、uh, I think I'll make it to the city like after four. That's when check out, check in usually happens. And I want to. I'm thinking maybe I could take a, another homeless, another hobo day there and then take two other days off. But then I lose one day on the road in Japan. I don't know what to do. I guess I can decide now. I don't know if any of you watched it. Two years ago, I did. I did this exact series and、uh, I tried to go to Niigata. I didn't even go get halfway there and I quit because of the rain or whatever my excuse was. But now look at me. Look at all the buildings that have been distance off. Yeah, I think it's Niigata. Whatever. It just shows I've grown. I think, even though I spent a lot more money on hotels this time. But,、uh, I mean, it's the, the cheap because of the coronavirus. What am I supposed to do? Just, just say no to that? I don't think so. I'm gonna take advantage. But, yeah, magical journey. So, while I was booking the hotel I'm staying at for tonight,、uh, this lady came up to me and、uh, she, she started out the conversation like what most people come up to me ask, like, where, where, where'd you come from? Like,、uh, and, and all that. And then she handed me. Now, two years ago, I was handed the same piece of paper. I think it's like a religious thing, uh, some uh, maybe even a cult, I don't know. But、uh, I remember two years ago, I had no idea what it was saying because my Japanese wasn't good enough. So maybe now, this time, I'll read it and I'll say, oh, all right. I don't know though. I don't know what it is. So, yeah, it took a little bit of time to try to read it. And,、uh, yeah, it's just a religious thing that I was trying to be recruited to. I, and、I've, it's happened before, I think I, I mentioned like two years ago. I think they just look. And find like lost looking people. And I was quite lost looking. <laughs> I almost have a beard going, and pretty much no one in Japan has a beard. But uh, uh, yeah, they probably just recruit them like that.、Uh, 
But I'm not gonna get into it. I don't want I don't want no religion in my life now. Whew. It's a lot of businessmen, maybe high school students. Anyway, I ended up staying three nights here, actually. Which uh, felt really good. Wanna see my trash? Who could have guessed? It's once again raining in Japan. <laughs> anyway, we're out of Niigata, so where are we going now? Is the is the big question, and the the short answer is towards Hokkaido. I'm gonna I'm gonna see how much ferries are uh, from from uh, Aomori uh, to Hokkaido, uh, just to see if I can bring my bike there. If I can't, then whatever. Uh, we're just gonna wing it. Also, my umbrella's broken. I kind of tried to open it while I was riding, like how the Terminator, to the Terminator, kind of like revolves his shotgun on a motorcycle, <laughs> but then it just like split. And, uh, and uh, long story short, it, so it is broken now. So now I have to find a place to throw it. Dang it. So I've made it to the town of Sasagawa Nagare. Sasagawa Nagare. And it's, uh, I mean, looks like a small town, isn't it? I thought, oh, nice, I can, uh, I can go to the supermarket here and I can get food and then I can sleep under a nice bridge. Uh, it looks, looks a little too small for that. I don't know. I don't know if there's gonna be that, that sort of luxury. I might have to rough it with, uh, with my ravioli that I have. I found a sweet cave that I thought, oh, maybe I can stay in here, but the ground is quite wet, which probably means the the waves reach over here, or they can. The ocean's right there. Very beautiful, though. Very cool. I don't know. You know what, actually? I might try it. The waves wouldn't go all the way up here, would they? I don't know. Whatever. I don't know if these are good to eat because of the rust at the bottom, but uh, it's cool. I'm gonna eat them. <laughs> the chopsticks. All right, so ravioli, best road food. Cause like, it tastes good cold, tastes good hot. You can, you know, you can eat it anywhere. It comes in a can and uh, it's like 80 cents a can. I got these all the way from America, by the way. Making some sort of announcement. I don't understand a word, what that means. 
Oh, I hope it's not about any waves coming.